Each box weighs 10 pounds. Find the center of gravity of the system. These are discrete weights. So I have a 10 pound weight here, another 10 pound weight in the middle, and a 10 pound weight at the end. I want to pick a point O at some distance away from the first spot. That means the next block is at D plus 2 feet away, and the third block is at D plus 5.5 feet away. My equivalent system is going to have something like a weight acting at the distance. To have my two systems be equivalent, I need to have the sum of the forces be the same and the sum of the moments be the same. So my sum of the forces here is 10 plus 10 plus 10. It's 30 pounds down. So I want to find my location x bar where I can put all of my 30 pounds and get the same sum of the moments. So my sum of the forces down here still needs to be 30 pounds and W has to be 30 pounds. Now I need to deal with these distances. The sum of the moments at O is 10 times D, whatever D is, plus 10 times D plus 2, plus 10 times D plus 5.5. That ends up being 30D plus 75. Now, if I say that this is some D2, then my sum of the moments here at point O is 30 times D2. Now what I want to really do is measure X bar from the left hand block. So this is where my left hand block was at some D away. This is X bar just because I said it was. So I want to let this D2 be equal to my original D plus the X bar so that I'm measuring from the left hand piece. That gives me 30 D plus 30 X bar. Once I have my sum of the forces matching, I need my sum of the moments to match. So up here I had 30 D plus 75. Down at the bottom I have 30 D plus 30 X bar. 30 Ds are going to cancel. You get X bar is 75 over 30 or 2.5 feet. So if I answer the question, the center of gravity of my systems is 2.5 feet to the right of the left hand block. If you measure it from O, you have to just be more specific about where O is. If you take point O somewhere very out, somewhere else or somewhere very specific, like at this left block itself, then my system, my original system, has the three 10-pound blocks. The weight of the left one goes through point O and doesn't create a moment at O. So I would get the middle block, 10 times 2, plus the right-hand block, 10 times 5 and a half. Both of those are, counter, uh, are clockwise. That would be 75 foot-pounds clockwise. My second system would just be O and X bar, 30 pounds. My sum of the moments at O is 30 times X bar, setting that equal to 75 foot-pounds clockwise. X bar is 2.5 feet.